From the Target 12 investigators, a letter to parents of Gordon School students identifies a teacher accused by several, uh, accused by several students of molestation. And we found out police findings are under review by the Attorney General, although the statute of limitations has run out on some possible charges. Target 12 investigator Walt Buteau joins us now in studio with the details. The teacher has not been charged and according to the letter sent home to parents denies the accusations. The letter states since the claims were first revealed in June, more accusations have surfaced. The school hired an attorney in the spring, according to the letter that was sent out to parents today. The investigation revealed the allegations involved, quote, numerous instances of inappropriate touching and digital rape that occurred on campus and in two cases, allegations of rape that occurred off campus. According to the letter, the teacher worked at Gordon between 1972 and 1977, but even after victims shared their allegations with administrators at the time, the teacher stayed on the job. He was eventually put on paid leave after one of the rape victims went to East Providence Police. But current investigators have not responded yet to questions from Target 12 why the teacher was never charged, telling Target 12 the case remains under investigation. The letter states after police got involved, the teacher never returned to work at Gordon, although it has been reported that he may have taught at other schools after leaving. The school has not released where the teacher may have taught after he left the East Providence Private School. The head of school said in the letter Gordon has examined its hiring and sexual misconduct reporting practices in recent months and come to the conclusion that the school is up to date and consistent with best practice. Target 12 has reached out to the former teacher through his attorney, but we have not heard back from him at this time. An attorney general spokesperson tells us the case is under review. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.